This lesson is on counting quarters and dimes. When we count quarters and dimes, we need to start with quarters first because they're worth more and then add our dimes, which are worth 10. And don't forget that quarters are worth 25. Well, we know that two quarters are worth 50 cents. We're done counting by quarters, and we need to add 10 because now we're moving to dimes. So we'd say 50, this dime would make 60, another dime would make 70, another dime would make 80, and another dime would make 90. This group of coins is worth 90 cents. Let's look at another group of coins. We know that two quarters are 50 cents. Now we need to add our tens. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. We don't say 100 cents, we say $1, because 100 cents is equal to $1. So we draw our dollar sign, and our one, that represents $1, decimal point, and two zeros that represent no change left over. Let's look at another group. In this group, we have one quarter and one, two, three, four, five dimes. This is a little trickier because we know that one quarter is 25 cents. When you add 10 to a number where the digit in the ones place is not a zero, it's a little bit harder. But all you need to remember is that the digit in the ones place stays the same, so that's going to stay 5, and the digit in the tens place is going to go up 1. So let's count this together. We said that a quarter is worth 25, one more dime, would make 35. The 5 stayed the same, but the tens place went up 1. The next would be 45, 55, 65, 75. This group of coins is worth 75 cents. Let's count some more. There's our quarter again. We know that's worth 25. Now remember, the 5 is going to stay consistent, and in the tens place it will go up one. So it's 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95. This group of coins is worth 95 cents. Let's count another group of coins. Here we have three quarters. Remember, three quarters is equal to 75 cents. Remember, our five is going to stay the same, and our tens place will go up on when we add the dimes. So it would be 75, one more dime would make 85. One more dime would make 95. This group of coins is worth 95 cents. This concludes our lesson today on counting quarters and dimes.